Almost a quarter of the manufactured products in the world today are made in China. According to the CIA's World Factbook, China ranks second on the list of nations with the greatest industrial output, the United States being the first. But that may not be the case for long. One of the reasons is that Chinese companies are increasingly replacing human workers with robots. MIT Technology Review editor Will Knight recently visited China. He spoke via Skype. The grand plan is to, rather than to see manufacturing, you know, move to different countries as it moves, say, from the US to China, they want to hold on to it by just investing a lot in automation and robotics. Knight says two factors contribute to the move, an open attitude towards whatever helps get things done and a desire by Chinese workers to move away from low-skilled jobs. I was really struck by the spirit of innovation and the speed of innovation and how everybody was on board with that. It's amazing how much the, the workers actually themselves were, were really involved with helping to redesign the, the um, the production lines to introduce more mechanization, more automation. Currently, Chinese companies are buying most of their industrial robots from U.S. and European manufacturers. But last summer, Chinese appliance giant Midia acquired the largest share of ownership in Germany's KUKA, one of the biggest manufacturers of industrial robots. Other companies are developing their own intelligent machines. Big, big companies like Foxconn, which makes the, the iPhone, is, is pouring huge amounts into developing robots, and they're really determined to make it work, make it happen. Knight says both the Chinese government and private companies have programs designed to retrain workers who will be replaced by robots. And he adds, as the current trend towards automation continues, the US and Europe will have to step up their game if they want to keep pace with China. George Putich, VOA News, Washington.